Hey guys, welcome to day 16 of Vlogmas. It's nighttime already, it's like five. The sunset tonight is so beautiful. I wanted to show you guys just a little glimpse of it. Tonight I'm showing you my nighttime routine, but I'm going to CVS right now to actually pick up a Christmas gift that I got for Martin. It's something that I can't say because he's still here, but it's like a photo item. I got it printed in the photo lab, so I have to go pick it up. It's been ready for like two, three weeks, but I haven't gotten it, so I'm gonna go do that right now. I just got back from CVS and I went to go pick up some packages that I had downstairs and I was super excited to see my new Ana Luisa package. So you guys know Ana Luisa is my favorite jewelry company. They are completely carbon neutral and a sustainable jewelry brand. They eliminate all the cost of like upcharges from more expensive jewelry companies. So you're paying what you should be paying for this quality of jewelry. It's really high quality jewelry and you're getting it at the most affordable price you can. So everything is 14 karat gold and sterling silver they only use the best materials this one is actually a real diamond with solid 14 karat gold not just gold plating but most of the more affordable ones of course are just gold plated on sterling silver and they sent me three necklaces I'm so excited they're actually having a sale until December 26th their whole site is buy one get one 40% off plus you get a free travel case the free travel case is only if you spend $150 or more get yourself some things get some gifts for people but yeah let's get into this so each item comes in its own little dust bag and I have some earrings from Ana Luisa I have this necklace and I have a ring from them so now I have three more necklaces I thought all of these would look really good snacked with my little simple diamond I do need to get some chain extenders though because I think they're all around the same length so this is the first piece it's called the Anna gold and ever since I got this necklace I really wanted this one because I thought they would just layer together really nice Nicely. I love how Ana Luisa's pieces layer. I feel like they're just the best for layering. So this is 100% recycled sterling silver so you can see how sustainable they are. I love sustainability. Everything I buy, I try to make it sustainable. Some cases it's just not available but things like jewelry, I really want them to be sustainable. So it's 100% recycled sterling silver but it's plated with 14 karat gold and all of their items have a 365 day warranty if anything goes wrong. This cost $59. And then I have the Vita necklace which is $89. This is also 100% recycled silver coated with 14 karat gold plating and it also has cubic zirconia in the little diamonds. This I also thought would be super adorable with my little diamond because the V shape I feel like could just lay right below the diamond. The last necklace I got is called the Rosa necklace. I really like this one because it's a bit bigger. This one is actually brass with 14 karat gold plating. So this one is a little bit more affordable even because it's brass not sterling silver this is just a little moon with a little tiny star or Sun cubic zirconia piece I think this is so adorable also would be so nice layered with the other pieces I feel like all of them just go really well together because they are all by the same brand and I think this is a collab with someone named Rosa because it has a special little dust bag most of them look like this and it is only $50 so you can tell the prices on Ana Luisa are very fair they cut out the middleman that is often there in jewelry companies which makes the price so ridiculously high for nice fine jewelry like this all of Ana Luisa's pieces start at only $39 but they do have higher quality more luxurious pieces like the solid gold with diamonds of course it's gonna be more expensive they have something for everyone it's literally the best gift to give or give yourself I also got a package from first aid beauty I bought this stuff I literally love the ultra repair cream I got it on Black Friday or Cyber Monday it took a really long time to come in I got the ultra repair cream in the squeezy tube because I love squeezy tubes honestly I didn't really like the tub it's just really annoying to dig into it especially when you have nails like this the lotion just gets like all stuck under your fingers and it's not very pleasant so I love that it's in a squeezy tube you can use this on your face you can use it on your body recently I've just been using it on my body but I always used to use it on my face all the time so yeah it's just a really good thick lotion for sensitive skin and I also got a little baby one for my grandmother because she has the driest hands ever and honestly I think this is one of the best lotions there are so I wanted to give this to her for Christmas but another huge thing I got is the KP bump eraser body scrub everyone said it is literally a miracle product in the reviews and I've heard other people talk about it so I just really wanted to try it on my legs sometimes I get bumps on like the back of my thighs and like my butt area 
area. But that's my little haul for today, my online shopping packages. And now I'm going to cook dinner. I don't know what I'm gonna make, so I guess we'll find out together. So I decided for dinner, I'm going to make some of this vegan chicken with pasta that we had left over and some spinach. So right now I have a clove of garlic. This garlic tool is amazing. If you use garlic, you should definitely get this. I have oil in the pan right now, and then you just squeeze it. And the garlic just comes out so nicely, as you can tell, and it, you don't have to chop it. And it always gets stuck, so I just take a little knife and scrape it in there. It already smells so good. I literally am obsessed with garlic. And I'm just gonna put some of the chicken in here. It's just like tofu, but like more chicken-like. It's made of soy, mainly. That's why I say it's like tofu. I'm just cooking for myself tonight because Martin is at his parents' house. So that honestly might be too much, but whatever. Cook up the chicken first, and then I will add the pasta because that's already cooked, so it makes it super easy for me. And I'm gonna add some seasonings. This is garlic and herb seasoning. More garlic because... I'm obsessed. Now that it's been cooking a little, I'm adding salt and I'm gonna put in my pasta. Then I'm adding in some Italian seasoning and a little bit of basil. I'm gonna add a little bit of pasta sauce. The pasta already has sauce on it, but it's from yesterday, so it's not like fresh. So I just want it to be a little more saucy. Now I'm going to add spinach. Gotta get your greens in. Obviously a lot of spinach, but it cooks down so small that it's like pretty much nothing. That is my dinner for the night. Pasta with red sauce vegan chicken and spinach. Looks really good. I eat this. Obviously it's super hot so I have to wait a little bit. But I got my water here too. Now that I ate dinner, it's time to actually start my night routine. So I put my hair up and recently I've been using this little panda thing to pull my hair back when I wash my face. Usually I wash my face in the shower actually but for the video purpose I'm going to show you how I wash my face. So first step is take out my contacts. I use BioTrue Solution. And then to take off my makeup, I use the Makeup Eraser Towels. This one actually isn't Makeup Eraser brand. It's just like an off-brand makeup remover towel. But yeah, they're just way better than using makeup wipes. Makeup wipes are bad for your skin and the environment, so just a lose-lose there. I know they have like oils and stuff too, so just use anything but a makeup wipe, honestly. Anything is better. So I just remove my makeup. You can tell it comes off really easily all my foundation and everything. And I do it on my neck also because I wear makeup on my neck. And then I wash my face. I use these two products. My cleanser is the Youth to the People Kale and Green Tea Spinach Vitamins Superfood Cleanser. It's such a good cleanser. Very gentle and just like fresh. And then I use the 4IO Skin Cleansing Brush. It's like one of these little plastic brushes that just scrub your face. They help you wash your face. So I always wet the brush and wet my face. And I prefer to take the cleanser and put it onto my face first and get a little bit of a lather. And then I go in with the brush and this vibrates. It literally died. It's I've had it for so long and I never charged it or anything and it was fine until I'm literally filming this video, but you can kind of do the same thing without the vibrations. Just use it to go around and it just really gets into your pores deeply and gets all the dirt, bacteria, oil, and makeup out of your pores. And then I just rinse my face, obviously. I'm doing a face mask tonight actually also, so this is the Youth to the People Yerba Mate Resurfacing Energy Facial and I love this. It's so good, it makes my fin it makes my it makes my skin feel amazing after, so I need to dampen my skin again. Usually I do all of this in the shower, but as I said I wanted to show you guys. So I use this little skincare brush when I'm not in the shower just because it's really nice. My sister gave it to me, I think you can get them on Amazon and stuff, but yeah I just Get the mask all over my face. 
just going to go in with my hands to smooth it out because this mask is kind of hard to smooth out with that thing. So just coat this on my face. And now I'm going to hop in the shower. Obviously I'm not gonna show you guys in the shower, but I'll show you guys the products I use right now. I'm not washing my hair tonight. I just washed it last night. So I'm going to start off with body wash. This is the Native Sugar Cookie Body Wash. It smells so good, literally just like a sugar cookie. I love it. And I just use my loofah to wash my body. Then I'm going to go in with my body scrub, Tree Hut Candy Cane Body Scrub. I love Tree Hut scrubs. They're literally the best ones I've ever tried. I've tried a lot of scrubs in my day, but these leave like a nice oil on you, but it's not greasy. It just like keeps you moisturized. To shave, I use these two products. This is the Tree Hut Tahitian Vanilla Bean Tahitian. I said that weird. Moisturizing shave oil. I'm literally almost out of it. It's really good. I love shaving with this. It's the best like products I've used to shave. And then I use my little flamingo razor and that's all I do in the shower. So I'm gonna do that and then I'll be back. I'm out of the shower. I just used my new First Aid Beauty Ultra Repair Cream all over my body just to stay moisturized after my shower. Now I'm putting on my nighttime moisturizer. It's apparently a night mask, but honestly, I think it's just a thick moisturizer that I use at night. It's also youth to the people. I'm running very low. I need to get a new one. But this is the Super Berry Hydrate and Glow Dream Mask. It has maki, I don't know what that is, vitamin C, squalene, and hydronic acid. So it's very nice for the nighttime. It keeps my skin very moisturized. So I just put this all over, all over my face. And I also put it under my eyes for some moisture. And I heard eye cream is literally just expensive moisturizer. So now I don't use eye cream. I just put my moisturizer under my eyes. And I put on my deodorant. This is also native sugar cookie scent. Literally the best scent ever. I'm so happy I got this. Kids daily vlog appearance. <laughs> Having a little bit of ice cream now. It's this one. I've actually never tried it. It's the Van Leeuwen. I don't know, <laughs> but it's peanut butter chocolate chip. It's made mainly of cashew milk and then coconut cream, peanut butter, chocolate chips. I just brushed my teeth, now it's like 11, so I'm ready to go to sleep. I'm taking my hair out of this bun. I put it in a bun for my shower. It's like stuck in here. <laughs> then I just put my hair in a braid. I sleep with it in a braid when I keep it natural. If it's curled or straightened, then I don't. I just leave it down, but when it's natural, I braid it because it gives it a little better texture and I feel like I just wake up in the morning with it looking better. And that's it, all ready for bed. Martin is already asleep and he looks very uncomfortable. He stole my side of the bed tonight, but that's okay. I'll sleep on the other side. I like his side better anyway. But yeah, that was today's Vlogmas video, my night routine. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Thank you guys so much for watching and have a good day. Bye.